Good afternoon, Keepers of the Cash. Happy new comic book day. Hope everyone's having a great week and you are getting some great books. And while we're on the subject, new books are here. Let's take a look. All right, so first up for the pick this week, we have Red Sonia number 10 by Mirka and Dolfo. Cool cover there. And. Another cool cover, Merca and Dolfo, uh, Red Sonia, number 10. And one more, the Joseph Michael Isner cover. So that's the three covers I got for that this week. Again, not a big haul, but I always tend to get some extra covers. I, I may stop, but who knows. Uh, Berserker, number 9, getting towards the end of this, so... I'm waiting. I read the first three issues, really liked it, so I'm just waiting until it ends now so I can just read it in one sitting and enjoy the whole story as something complete. All right, next up, we have Thor, Lightning, and Lament. I believe this is a one-shot. Looks like a knock cover there. So we'll see how that is for a one-shot. I can't wait for Banner War to be done so Thor can just go back to being its regular monthly self. Without all this tie-in nonsense. Not a big fan of the tie-in. Uh, next up, The Variants, Jessica Jones. So this, uh, premise of this is a bunch of different Jessica Jones from different multiverses. And uh, thus, The Variants. And we got another cover of it right here. This is my favorite one. Just absolutely beautiful. Phil Noto cover. So gorgeous, gorgeous. And then we have Spider-Man 2099 Exodus. I had to get the one um, with uh, Monica Rambeau on the cover. Although I may go back and get that border cover one too because I really like that one as well. Next up, we have She-Hulk number four. Had to get the one with the Thing and Jennifer Walters both on the cover. Just a great fun cover. And a uh, solid background reminds me of the older days of comic covers. So pretty nice. And next up, we have the variant edition of She-Hulk right there. Fun look at all the different kind of She-Hulks through the ages on this cover. Representing Jen and all her fabulousness throughout Marvel history. Next up, all right, my uh, book I am looking forward to reading to the most this week. Iron Cat, number one, John Tyler Christopher uh, action figure variant. So a lot of fun there. Then we have Iron Cat number one. All right, Ron Lim variant. And, uh, or is that the A cover? No, Ron Lim variant. So nice cover. Then we have Iron Cat number one. This is just the regular A cover. And uh, beauty it is. And then last, and this is my cover of the week. I absolutely love this cover. I actually didn't look at who did it, but um, ooh, looks like a could be an art germ cover. It looks like Iron Man and Hellcat Annual number one. And look at that Hellcat! Just a beautiful cover. And uh, I'm not collecting Iron Man, but cover by here, and I'll probably give the annual a read, but. Just a beautiful Hellcat cover. But that's it for this week. That's all I got, guys. Let me know what you got. Let me know what you think of my pickups. I know I'm very Marvel-focused and a few indies here or there. But lately, at least in my last few hauls, I've had more indies than the big two. Uh, this week with um, the Iron Cat coming out, I had to have it. But that's it for now, guys. Until next time, keep it casual.